Hello, welcome to St. Mary's Star of the Sea School. I'm Sister Mary John, principal of St. Mary's. I've been here for seven years. This is my eighth year. As you know, our school has been here since 1923, and we have educated children, hundreds of children, uh, over all these years. We have pre-K three students now to, through eighth grade. Uh, as, as each year goes by, the buildings age. Uh, we get new students, but our buildings need upgraded. And today, I'm here to appeal to you through I Give Catholic fundraising to show and show you some of the projects we are in need of your help. Here I am in the lower school building, and I'm showing you one of our classrooms where we have a clean, comfortable, good lighting environment because of your donations. As winter comes, we're going to be able to use the heating unit that we replaced last year with this AC unit. And we'll be sharing with you how more of our rooms need that changeover so that in the winter and the summer, we can use the heating and the air and um, air conditioning unit that will work throughout the year and we do not have to use our boiler system. So thank you for consideration and helping to, us to continue to have environments for our students where they can learn in a comfortable and safe environment. God bless you. Here we are at one of the projects that we're looking at replacing, our awning that is original to this upper building school. As you can tell, it's got holes in it, which is not doing a very good job at actually protecting students and families as they enter the building. So one of the other things we would like to um, look at in the future is extending this awning into the cafeteria so students could walk under a covered walkway while entering both buildings. Here we are standing in front of our cafeteria facing the water and as you can tell one of our other projects that we have to work on is our guttering system. Our gutter has a pretty big leak in it and we've tried to repair it which has not worked. So we'd like to replace the guttering that runs the entire length of the building so we don't have students getting water as it rains dripping on their head. Here we are on the lower building part of the property and you can see one of our brand new AC units that we had replaced this summer that has failed. Our old units are 31 years old plus on our property and as the time goes they're going to start failing on a regular basis. As well as that we are replacing AC units with heat pumps because our infrastructure with the pipes underneath the floors in this building are boiler system and we've had some failed pipes over the past year. So what we'd like to do is replace those AC units with heat pumps so we can get rid of that boiler system and not have that problem again with replacing flooring. Here we are on the convent porch. Our convent is the oldest building on the campus, built in 1923. Over the years, we have made repairs and improvements. A current improvement need is our laundry room. The, the floor board, the floor boards, and the uh, whole area needs to some renovation. So we're going to just show you a little picture of that. And I know many alumni have fond memories of our convent uh, graduation on the convent steps. Um, visiting our chapel and uh, the many sisters that have lived here over the years. So we are so grateful for any improvements that can be made. And this is one improvement that would, would help the life of the sisters. Thank you. Here we are in the convent laundry room. And what we would like to do here is replace the floor that is starting to fail. We do have some floor joists that are starting to sag quite a bit, which is causing our washing machine, as you can tell, we have a temporary repair in here for right now. We'd also like to do some work on the walls and repair the walls that need repairing, as well as repairing and replacing this uh, sink, this double sink, that is, um, we would guess, somewhere around 60 to 70 years old. So that is one of the other things. And then we would also like to relocate the dryer so it's next to the washing machine to make it a little bit more convenient for the sisters and all the duties that they do around here. So 
So here we are in the lower building, the music room, which was built in 1955. And some of your donations that have gone into the repairs of the school have been these windows that were done four years ago, the LED light fixtures that were done last summer, which have now reduced our energy costs in this building by 70%. Thank you for joining us and seeing all the great things happening here at St. Mary's School and we thank you for your donations that will provide a safe, loving and beautiful environment for our students. God bless you. Have a great day.